in the control system I am going to talk about the Mason scan formula and this Mason scan formula is used for a signal flow graph the main use of this Mason scan formula is that this method is useful for finding out the transfer function or this transfer function is also known as transmittance of a linear signal flow graph This Mason scan formula in short we are going to na name it as um, G F stands for Mason scan formula. This MGF it is used used to find the transmittance or a transfer function the another name of transfer function is transmittance of a linear signal flow graph for the signal flow graph in short we can name it as SFG which stands for signal flow graph the overall gain can be determined by this Mason's gain formula this overall gain is nothing but let's assume we have the system as G of S which is having input or excitation as x of s and the output is going to be y of s then this g of s is the, going to be the overall gain which is equals to this y of s by this x of s in other words this overall gain is nothing but the transfer function or the transmittance of this linear signal flow graph so this Mason's gain formula it is as I've said it is used to find the transfer function. So the overall gain can be written as let's name it as a capital T which is equal to some summation starts from this n equals to or this k equals to 1 and stops at the finite number of branch and this n stands for the number of oral paths where this k is going to start from this one and it is going to stop at this n where this n is the number of oral paths which is equals to p1 del1 plus p2 del2 plus p3 del 3 plus dot 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 up to pn del n all divided by this del where this del is going to be determinant of a graph 
del is the determinant of graph that involves closed loop gain and the mutual interaction between it can be two or more non touching branches this del which is equals to 1 minus sum of all individual loop gains plus sum of the product of uh, some gain of branches uh, for all two or more non touching loops some of this gain products of all possible two non touching loops minus of sum of grain products of all three or all, or this of all possible three non touching loops plus sum of gain products of all possible for non touching loops minus of and this is going to be uh, keep on continuing and coming to this del subscript k this will be the value of del obtained by removing all the loops touching the gate forward but so this is about the Mason's gain formula and we are going to have we have the standard expression which is used for to find out the overall gain of any linear signal flow graph uh, so there will be a linear signal flow graph and based on looking on that we need to find out 
this overall gain of that signal flow graph and before doing that we need to find out the individual loop gains one or more and two non-touching loop gains three non-touching loop gains and so on and after finding out all those loop gains we need to find out this del and p1 del1 p2 del2 p3 del3 and so on